Hey, what's going on everyone? So today I'm here again with another review. This is a long overdue review. I got this product maybe two to three months ago and I got so busy with moving and starting a new job that I just never got around to doing it or even opening this product in general and using it. So today I had a little bit of free time and I just opened up the product and got it all set up. So we're gonna see my first opinion on actually trying this out. And so the actual product is a smart digital body scale. And by smart, it has an app that you connect to your phone compatible with both Google and Apple. So you can use it pretty much with whatever kind of phone you got, it's most likely gonna be compatible with it because it goes back to a pretty, pretty old software updates. And so this company Wong KUO, I don't know exactly how to say it, but I don't want to butcher it. They sent me this scale for free just to try it out. And if I wanted to, I could do a video review on it and just show you guys what it is. So I just went ahead and started the video on my first attempt at trying it just to get the raw impression of it. And like I said, I already set it up, downloaded the app. The scale itself is battery operated and it comes with four AAA batteries. It only uses three, so you get one extra and I already got it plugged in to the scale. And as you can see, the box is empty right now because I already got it set up. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get on into it. So I got the scale set up right here in my bathroom, right by the door. It has the four little silver things on the edges. That's the sensors. And again, battery operated scale is ready to go. You just open the app up. Okay, so checking out the app right here, you open it up, I'm on an Android device. So this is, it might look a little different if you have an Apple device or something else. If you click on the top left corner, it has me. If you look on the, we're on the homepage right when you open the app, this is what you pop onto. It has my BMI, today's weight that I did just now, uh, fat percent, and then physical fitness report. This question mark button, it gives you all this information. As you can see, it's compatible with both Fitbit and Apple Health, as well as Google Health. And so pretty much any type of tracking device, you're most likely gonna be able to connect it to this account and have your scale connected to it as well. So it could all be used interchangeably and not have to worry about having different apps and stuff like that. If you hit these little bars right here, you can track uh, trends and historical data from days, weeks, and months. Like I said, this is the first time I used it, so all you got today on there. And then you can switch over to BMI, your fat, muscle weight, all that stuff. And if you actually want to just weigh yourself, you hit this start weighing button, click on it, and then you're able to go ahead and step on the scale. And then once the scale decides your weight, it'll show both on the scale and on here, 141.53. If you stay standing on the scale, it'll gather all that extra information that we've seen earlier. And then you can hit this physical fitness report button. And then you see all this extra information, body shape, it says fit. So you can see I'm not slim, I'm not athletic. I'm right in the middle, perfect weight, I guess you could say. Uh, nutrition, it says perfect. Body weight, I mean, it's right there. I guess I'm standard. BMI, 23, I'm standard again. Fat, I am just barely healthy. Muscle weight, I'm a little better than standard. Uh, I don't know what that word is, fat, standard again. Water level, standard. Skeletal muscle rate, standard. I'm pretty standard, I guess I'm a basic old person. Bones, standard. Metabolism, I think my metabolism is a lot faster than it should be, but who knows, fat weight, just borderline of healthy. Skeletal muscle, standard. It just keeps on going on and on and on. And then I guess you can get a PDF version of it as well. Oh, look at that. Ideal weight is 135. That's not what I want. I want to be 160. Um, weight control, I guess to get to that ideal weight, I got to lose six pounds, but forget that I'm trying to gain 19. 
muscle control i don't know i guess i'm man it says my current muscle mass is standard so i'm not i'm not as buff as i thought i was but i know i'm not especially since i haven't been hitting the gym uh yeah it's just got all this extra information that i guess you could say is useful if you you're into all that stuff and that's calculated from those sensors on the edges of the scale so like i said you just keep on standing on there so it can calculate all this stuff and that's pretty much it whenever you first set up your app account you just make a profile name use your email and a password and then from there it just asks a few basic questions about yourself and then to actually set up the scale all you have to do is put the batteries in allow the location to be seen through the app and then they connect automatically i don't know how it works but it does so i'm not going to question it and that's about it for that so for me what i think about this scale just off of using it this one time it seems like a pretty useful scale it gives you a lot of information a lot more than a, your basic old scale would use it looks pretty nice and sleek nice little glass type platform super light and the scale i used to use is right over here this guy i mean all it does is your weight and that's it but this one gives you all that extra information and is connected to your app and the thing that shocked me the most about this scale is that how cheap it is like i would expect a bluetooth scale that's smart like that has its own app and you can connect it to popular things like apple watches and fitbits and your samsung health and all that stuff you know you'd think it'd be in the 50s or 60 dollar range but this scale right now i just looked at it it's 16.99 and i mean i don't know how much scales normally go for but 16.99 sounds like a crazy good deal for everything that this one does so again not being paid or anything to hype up this scale but 16.99 is a crazy good deal I don't know what the scale market is like, but if you need a scale, this one's been working so far so good for me. Haven't touched it in three months since I got it and it's still good to go. So I guess you could say it's got a good lifespan on it. I will leave a link in the description. I think you can buy it on Amazon. And when I looked at it today, it had an extra 5% off if you use this Amazon coupon. So you can get it even cheaper. It'll probably be right at $16 if you bought it with that coupon. And if you have any questions about the scale or want any other information about it, of course, leave a question in the comments and I'll answer it as soon as possible. And again, that company that sent me this right there, Wong Kuo, I guess. I don't know how you say it, but honestly, good scale can't beat that price. And I guess I will see you guys in the next video.